That was totally crash. Wait a minute. What? Why am I wearing this? Who am I? Just kidding. I'm not playing Bart Allen in the CW show. I couldn't help but not set up that joke in the beginning of this. Uh, because I kind of do look like a meet in the middle of the two actors who play Iris and Barry. I couldn't help myself but not do it. But, um, <laughs> um, let's talk about my thoughts on the Arrowverse. Um, honest thoughts. I wanted to just give a full on, not rant, but just overview of where it, each show as it is, as future speculations on what I could see happening in this universe. Now, um, let's start with Arrow. Um, my hopes for season six is we get the reveal of um, Dorian Chase being vigilante. I'm, ex I'm, I'm kind of expecting that a bit. You know, I, I'm, I have been theorizing that it's Dorian Chase, uh, um, Adrian's brother, are, could be a different interpretation of the character for the show. Um, but there was an imposter storyline of, uh, Prometheus, and I was thought that was going to be where they were going to go for the Prometheus character. Guess not, though, but, um, those, that, those two characters were in that story, Vigilante and Prometheus were in that sh story, so I was thinking, wait a minute, is that kind of what they're going to be doing? But, um, not really, um... Didn't feel disappointed with this season so far. It's, um... As much as season four and season three were a dip in quality for me as a fan of the first two seasons, um, I know there's, a sp I know it's a, a drama series because they're, they want to do these dramatic things when it comes to relationships and reveals and big bad being added to the series. Um, I. I you know, it's just seeing a little bit too formulaic, and I hope they change up the status quo for the next series, and that'll be Flash, uh, season four. Uh, what I hope, I uh, hope out of that, um, season, I hope they do something with the Rogue storyline, um, maybe they can do, uh, I don't know who they can do for the lineup for the show, but I'm pretty sure the writers have an idea of what they're planning on doing. And that's that. Um, but honestly, um, not that much um, for how I feel the reveal of Savitar. Kind of felt it disappointing. I was thinking it was going to be Eddie uh, or Cobalt Blue, as a lot of people were thinking at the time, because he's a blue character and he's referring himself as the future Flash, implying that he is a version of the Flash that's blue. And yet there is a storyline called Future Flash. But I was thinking it was going to be Cobalt Blue. Like a merge. Because like, the Savitar in this show looks nothing like the Savitar from the comics. And he looks, looks more in line of the Savitar costume. Looks more in line to be like Cobalt Blue. I, was, I thought they were going to do that reveal. Um, and I think that would have been an, an interesting way to go. But they didn't do that. They did a time remnant story arc um, on the series. Um, that's kind of not convoluted. It's just kind of hard to explain in, in a lot of details. I'm not going to get into it. But if you want me to talk about my theories on the show, I will share it with you guys. I'm hoping that somehow they get to do the character of Blue Cobalt. Because I think he's a character that's integral to the character of the story of how Barry is. A lot of them are doing a lot of personal stories, so I think if they want to do a villain that's personal stories, it's just perfect setup for, um, Cobalt Blue. And I'll, I'll, I'm hoping they can do something like that with the character possibly in Season 4, or uh, they could do Rogue Wars. They can do something like that. Um, I don't know who, how they could do it. Um, maybe they could do, uh, Isolated episodes with the rogues and having one be the main villain, main setup for the main characters, and Captain Cold's not going to be in the series anymore. Um, maybe they can do Killer Frost in that role. Maybe they could do that. Um, but leading it, maybe they can do. Uh, it's like a team working for somebody who wants to ruin the Flash team. And I, I know that's kind of formulaic, but it's formulaic in a personal story. So I would think uh, Rogues, the Rogue War, and Savitar, I mean, the Rogue War and 
Blue Cobalt would be an interesting way to go for Season 4. And that's what I'm hoping, my hopes are, for that. Um, Legends, Season 3. Um, I like that um, Season 2. It was interesting enough for that to be interesting. But I, I don't know what to think about that. Um, I, I'm not sure where the where I, I expect what... My expectations are for that. Maybe they can bring in the Legion more. Maybe they can do more Legion characters. Because in the comics, Supergirl and a mix of other characters that are somewhat in the universe are in that uh, in that lineup. Maybe they can do something like a setup for a spinoff or Superman or something like, um, I don't know. Or they can spin off uh, other characters into uh, Legend Season 3. A character I hope to see in uh, it would be uh, Constantine, John Constantine. I think Matt Ryan did a very great job in that series that he did, and him being brought back to play the character in Arrow season four, I think was an interesting way to go, and that would be that for um, Legends. Um, them launching another series app, um, there's a lot of, uh, I guess they're going to be launching an app that has an exclusive show on it. Um, I'm hyped to see what they do for that show, uh, Titans or something. That'll be cool. I can't wait to see that be adapted into a live action interpretation. Maybe they can pull from a mix of all their shows and do like psychics. Um, they could probably do Roy, um, Wally. I don't know. Um, but. That's that for how I feel about them. But, yeah, that's that for my thoughts on the Arrowverse as of 2017. And I will do another DC-related video this week where I talk about why the DCEU should be canceled. I already mentioned I was going to do that video in my last video before this, but I'm going to wait, you know, before I get into it. So if you like this video, comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye. And guys, I'm serious. I'm not playing Bart Allen. I'm not an actor.